We're out here in the Mojave Desert uh, with Limonera Company. This is a 640 acre uh, farm. We need to overcome, you know, all the challenges that we have and face. Uh, and the only way to do it is basically through innovation, technology, and initiatives like this one with LNC. What we have invented is a process called LNC, liquid natural clay. So this is a way where we take natural minerals like clays and we process them into a liquid nearly as thin as water. The beauty of this liquid is that we can apply it directly to the surface of the land and it will percolate in by the force of gravity and then create this soil structure that retains water and nutrients just like a sponge. So what we're basically looking uh, through this initiative of using LNC is to have a quicker result and definitely impact uh, the use of first the amount of water that we use in the desert uh, because it percolates so fast right the other part is the fuel usage uh, we in this environment here uh, we use uh, diesel fuel to generate power for all of our engines to get the water out the other thing and the other part of it is irrigation we never stop irrigating during the summer here so these are 24-hour cycles with people changing from one set to the other to the other. So there is a tremendous amount of labor in, included into all of this. Um, then the other part is uh, the fertilization, right? Um, we know that we're not very effective in delivering that amount of nutrients to the root systems. A lot of it will surpass. Um, so all of these are some of the you know, variables that we want to impact uh, with the use of LNC for sure. We're here in Cadiz now applying LNC for 2000 mm -hmm. trees. Uh, uh, what's next? <laughs> I, I want to do everything now. <laughs> uh, well, yes, this is going to be a very exciting year because uh, one of the things that I always repeat, you know, we, we need to measure it, right? We need to have that threshold. And so that's that's going to be our main focus this year is how do we how do we get our our trees on the crop year uh, that we can measure all these variables and and then sit down on the table, sharpen the pencil and actually integrate that into our cost formula, uh, into our business model. Right. And then once once that's said and done, um, then our next step is to deploy that in all of our desert operations, which uh, it, sh it could be soon. What do you think this can mean for agriculture in the Southwest uh, on, a, on, a, on a larger scale? This could definitely change um, where we do agriculture, right? Uh, most of the time, you know, we looked at deserts and the first inclination is why are we going to go do farming in the deserts with all the challenges that it represents but i think um we need to overcome that and overpass that and like i always say you know necessity is the mother of invention and so yes definitely i think going forward is something that we as farmers need to look into and uh, with the use of, of everything and all the tools that we have uh, at our reach of the hands, right? So yes, this could be mean. You know, this could mean a, a great future, also.